Spurs when it says it's not a toy, you're going, but it is totally a toy. This is a, this is exactly what it is. I bought it because it had pretty dice. <laughs> they had me at pretty dice. I thought they were for swallowing. <laughs> Welcome to Business Geek, and we're going to be playing Quarriers! Quarma, Quarmageddon? Yeah. With the Quarmageddon expansion. The Quarmageddon expansion and the main game in the box. Uh, it is... By WizKids. It is for two to four players, plays in about 30 minutes, and is for approximately 14 and up. But you can probably get away a little bit younger if they don't put the dice in their mouth. That's true. As it clearly says in the back of the box, this is not a toy. Not a toy. It's a game. Maybe that's the difference. It's a game, not a toy. Yeah, that's good. Right, let's go to the unboxing. Right, time for a classic unboxing. Stop. So, mm. before he gets going, because there are going to be dice everywhere, to explain, this was bought as part of the limited edition original release where it came in a big metal tin. Looks lovely. Terrible for storing dice. <laughs> So the Quarmageddon expansion is going to organise it all for you, but this is not representative of what you would get if you just bought the expansion. You do need to buy the base game as well. Technically, the tin is great for storing dice. Oh, it's amazing. Not very for organising yeah, dice. Yeah, I mean, as in, <laughs> it, it stores they the dice. They fit us. They're inside a giant tie. It looked amazing, but it's just literally like, which one do you want, David? Yeah. Oh, I need took, seven of these. It just took ages to organise your game, so. Oh, before, before he gets going, there's two game components here. Box with a few bits extra than the main game box. Okay, go. You get the starter piece, tells you where to, how many points you need for which players. Yes. Four to two players, blah, 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 all the way down. Rules. Rules with the things. Look, how to play the game. That will come later. And then you get this beautiful locking system. I'm going to take the whole tray out. Oh, man, I'm not looking forward to this. Yes. And so this is the beautiful system David has that's nice and locky. Look, it locks the dice in place, so once it's on in the box... <laughs> Taylor cannot ruin this. But, but sooner will. will. There you go, that's the lid of that. Then you get the cards. There you go, these are all the different uh, creatures. I think that's the monsters. Is it creatures or monsters? Creatures. Creatures, the different creatures. Angels and demons and oozes and slimes and, and there spells. Are spells as well yeah. that let you gates and things and stuff and you know I don't know that bags so you put your fingers in and take out things and then these are wooden cubes so you can keep where you are some mana some pawns a couple of bits that didn't fit and then you've got this bit here oh yes this is already feeling better than it should. And that's the game. <sighs> Let's play the game. No, now you pick up. Winning!
Should we do random? I'll go first? You go first. All right. So draw six. Draw. This is a green bag, apparently. It might look better green on the camera, but it's a well-loved green bag. Well-loved. What's it three? Come on. What's it three? Also, it's a low case spread. What have we got? We got that, that. Uh, I'm going to re-roll that and that. And I'm going to keep those. Okay. What do I get? Another reroll. Can I reroll again? Yeah, you can just uh, you can keep yes. using that face. A one and a one. Okay, I can get with that. So I have one, two, three, four. So you, I. You've got a total of six. Uh, I need one, though, to spend on this. So yeah. I can do this. So put in this. Mat. So your active pool. These are all now your active pool. Yeah, this is my active pool. I'll put them over here. Uh, I've spent one to cast or to summon this. Yes. And then I'll use another four to summon this. Uh, and I have one which would let me get an imp, but I do not want an imp. So in this situation, I have no creatures for Alan to attack. What? Uh, and he can't attack me. I don't exist. It's not like Magic the Gathering where I am a creature in effect with hers wound markers or anything like that. I find that's in life you don't exist. Rude. So... He does go to his attacks, and you must attack. There is no, no. choice. You just it happens. Whoosh, if you put there. a monster out there, it attacks, which sometimes you don't want to do. But you don't get damage back. You just basically run onto the battlefield and try to slay things. Yes. Them. So you do one damage to nothing. That gets wiped, and that gets ignored. Oh, let's just get them out and roll them. Four. So, what was that one? It's I got a total of six. Six. Goes into my active pool. So my six. I'm going to buy a. I'm allowed to buy one card from the wilds. Portal die. We don't know what I'm doing. You know what you're doing. Yeah, let's so, not pretend it is. And that goes into my used pile as well. Okay. And that's, so I, 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 I'm going to. Do I draw first? No, I score first. Score so I score first. one. Yes. So no, you make you make color die. I'm going to I'm going to an assistant. Call an assistant. Back in the wild it goes. It's a standard move. Predictable tailor. I'm going to draw hopefully six. Yeah, otherwise. Yeah. Max works. What I get? Reroll. Uh, I'll reroll. Oh, so that and a two, yeah. That and a one, I think. I'll just reroll that. I'll put those out. And I'll reroll this one. Oh, oh that's a lot to spend. One, two, See a dragon three, in your four, future. five, six, seven, eight, nine. Don't want. I think that's a bit too. That's a bit ambitious, isn't it? Dragging it up. Uh, just to save time, I'm going to shove it all in there. Yeah. And then I'm, I'm going to. Or, I'm going to. You can't affect this, can you? So I'm not going to just put that straight in my bag now. I wouldn't normally you do that. At I the have hour, no cards cause... yet. I have no abilities yet. So sometimes you will. I've also just lost an assistant on the floor, which I'm sure is going to happen quite a lot. I'm going to hunt for it. So I have seven this time. I think I need a creature. I'm going to go for a knight. Oh, do I, do I, do I? Yes, well, you've got a dragon now. I definitely... Knights kill dragons, so go for a knight. David. Yeah. I've lost an assistant. Can I have one out of the box? Thanks, David. It's probably under your chair, but I just couldn't see it. There's five. So let's move these up here for you. There we go. Let's put those in your ready area. Uh, so I've seven. got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm going to add these up I'm very quickly. Portal. I've been playing this a long time. Right, pop these Jeez. back into my bag. Don't, Don't lose me. Don't worry, I'm not you. It's a good thing for that, to be fair. And one more. Come on the portal. No. So no, you get to re-roll two. To re -roll these two. And so these two, it. yeah. I don't know why I was looking. They're all ones. I should have just gone with it. What the heck, yeah. Uh, another reroll. Re so I'll reroll these. So I'll keep those two and reroll these two. Why would you reroll the one? Because I want two more assistants. Okay. I want to score as much as I can, as quickly as I can. <gasps> yes, so we know what I'm doing. I'm putting three assistants out there. One, two, three. And unless Taylor can pull out a dragon and kill me. <gasps> Now I'm reliant on him not rolling a good dragon. Uh, I, as long as I get three points. Well, in fact... If no, not, it's six, because they've got two defenders. Yeah, no, I mean... 
as long as I get. So I need to get two points and a dragon. Two two bursts. Two bursts. Basically, you need the best dragon. Do I? Yeah, no, that's, that's the equivalent of rolling a six. There's only yeah. one with two bursts. I don't need two bursts though, because I can kill all six. Oh, I, I see. Six yeah. So basically, you need one of the, the highest. As long as it's the weakest dragon. Yeah. A little, little flump. Oh, yes! Uh, and no re rolls. No re rolls. That I have lucked out there. I've lucked out there. Okay, so I am going to put that there. That's my one. <laughs> yeah, those. That's that gold. Oh, I'll have it. You can't have That's it. That's fine, I'll keep it. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I have seven, so I am going to buy myself uh, an, a ghost. Do I want yeah. a ghost? Yeah, no. So it says, no? Okay. No. So uh, the, the, the gelatinous blob type character, um, he's called Mighty Primordial Ooze. He says he's equal to, all of his stats are basically equal to the number of creatures in your ready area. So he goes in with a load of little guys and becomes very big. But if he goes in with a big guy on his own, he's not very good. Um, the ghost, on the other hand, when the ghost spirit is destroyed, add it to your active pool, which is pretty good because it means next turn you'll get to roll it again. Because you get to roll anything in your active pool on, at, then. during your turn. I'll do that. That's my turn. Yeah. Right, so start my turn. I score three. You do score three. One, two, three. Takes the lead. Boom. And I know I cull these bad boys. All three? All three. Oh, wow. I'm going big. Right. Don't blame me for fun. Well, you get an opportunity to do that. That's kind of what they're there for. I have one die and I know what it is. It's time. Oh, right. So let's see what we've got. Oh, I just moved that. I didn't see where it was. Sorry. It's all right. It's a one now. It's a well, one that's fine. I think it might have been a one anyway. Yeah, a two. Yeah. It might be a two. So you, you didn't have a knight. Right, so I get to draw one more die for the portal, so we take that and put it into my spent pile. Bink. And let's take these out so I don't accidentally do the same thing I did again. Boom, 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 boom. And yay, I got, got six. Six to play with. I'm gonna take another knight. Okay. I get that. So I'm, I'm going to play. I'm gonna score, so I get two, and I'm gonna yeah. cut it. Yeah, I'll do me. I'm gonna add all of these to there. Mm. Put that in your active pool. Active pool. Ready to be rolled. Well, put it there. Put it there. One more. Okay. So yeah. roll all these. You're starting to see that too many dice in your bag and you get these turns where... Oh, I'm going to use that straight away. Two more. So I'm going to take all those out because so I'm going to keep those and I'm going to keep those. So just pop that into your spent pile. Yeah, and I'm going to get two out. Oh, well... Oh! Lord. <laughs> There's gonna be a lot, be a lot of picking up. I got loads to dragon. spend. Dragon, loads and loads. I need a dragon. Yeah, I'm in so much trouble when these. I put that there. What, what's the collective noun for a dragon? Uh, Flock. Oh no. What like seagulls? I don't know. A murder. Murder sounds. Murder's like crows, though, isn't it? A burn of dragons. Let's. Yep. Yeah, let's go. I'm gonna have a clash. That's what rhinos are called. Just so you're aware, a clash of rhinos. I need to kill your pawn. Maybe it's a flight, because there's a movie called A Flight of Dragons. Okay, we'll what go with that. that. I like a burn. That's fine. What did I get this time? Yes! Ooh. So let's move those two. He's great. Two, you more dice. two more dice. Two more dice. Yes. Oh, they will kill my dude. So, I will. I've got four. Let's put these out here. So you're going to use all of them to score your knights? Yes, I'm going to put the two knights into the ready area. Yes. And it says when he scores, right, so when he scores, it's next turn, and that's cost me two, and I've got two left, so I can buy anything that, no, no, nothing. So these just go away. And they attack him twice, they've got one attack. Stab, stab, uh, he dead. So I'm gonna draw the dice out of here. Fingers <laughs> crossed. Well, actually, they've, they've got five each. Five each, yeah. So, six, look at that. Mm. Uh, one extra and a re-roll. So you can re-roll that one if you wish. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna re-roll it. Shall I get these out your way? Do I, no, wait, wait, wait. Whoa, no, whoa, I'm going to keep the one. I'm going to keep the one. I'm gonna You're going to use it now. I'm going to do it now. Right, so put that in your spent anyway. For a dragon. <gasps> Go on so then. I'm going to roll the dragon. Yeah. And, and I'm going to re-roll the dragon. dragon. Well, shall I get these out of your way? Yeah. I got a dragon and I got the highest dragon. That's good. So he gets me uh, three is for that one, so that's that. And then that for my little dude. Yeah. Luckily, I only put you on nine. You can only kill one of my guys because it's ten in total you needed. Nine. Yeah. Yeah, couldn't so be right, better. I can count. So I'll kill this one. Yeah. 
Well, the same, but bonk. And I've got one left to do, which I won't use. They all go over there, and yeah. that is it for me. He scores, so it says I need to draw one additional die and add it to my active pile. So, so you draw seven dice, basically. Seven dice. We can do this. We've got maps. Oh, so he goes into... Oh, I can cull as well, so I'll cull him. I think he scores. I scored... One. Oh, no, 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 no here. he scored... Scored three. three. So I'm now on six. Bling. This is where your dragon is going to really hurt me. Because I'm going to have to kill it. So you get to draw two more. Well, one, two, three, four, five. So I'll put these in. Yep. I've got two more to draw. Then another two. I'm going to put this here because yeah. I'm assuming that's not going to be there. Yeah, all take, ones. take them all out and put them on the side. So two more. And then draw two, two more. Two more. I know two of these are knights. Come on, knights. So that's that's now used. Yes, the two knights. Beautiful. So one's a three, one's a one. So that'll cost me four. So let's pop these all into here. These have been rolled. Should we use all four? Because if you use all four, then you won't have any to buy anything with. So two, four, and I can get a three. There's a, a three spell. Cast this spell to rotate all creatures up one level. That sounds... Oh no, I can get an axe man. Yes, so I'll do that. I'll pay four to get my two knights out. Yep. Now, this dragon says um, no additional abilities. Creatures that are level two or less cannot attack, so only the other guy will attack, so it doesn't make a difference. He'll do two, but you'll soak it on your dragon, so that's yeah. fine. So then I'll buy an Axeman. Yep. Got an Axeman, what's he called? He's called Death Dealer, because I need something. Because if he can score, I can steal a dragon from your used pile. Yeah. That would be good. So, uh, yeah, I attack you for a total of three. No, you no, can, no, 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 yeah, he attacked me for so, two. Yeah, two. But you can just soak it on your yeah, dragon. Yeah, soak on the dragon. Protect so your little pawn. The dragon scores? Yes, and scores you. Four. 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 And the so, other dude scores me one. Yep, yeah. blink, blink. And you can cull two. Uh, I will cull these two. Put my hand this time, rather than straight into the bag. So I went wrong last time. Okay. Six. Neither of us are halfway yet, but I feel your dragon strategy is going to pay off massively. Two, four, six, six. Uh, I'm going to use that straight away. And yeah. I'll put those there, just in case I want to re-roll one of them. Yeah. Four, two. Come on, two dragons. That'd be good. That's not two dragons. It's a ghost. So two. I will activate the dragon. I mean, I'll activate the <laughs> ghost. That's not what I meant to say. Yeah. You'll cast the ghost. And I'll cast the ghost for one. Active area. Blink. One, two, three, four, five, six. I have six to spend. Mm. I will use the six and I will get myself a portal. Right. In which case, I score a total of six for my two guys. Oh, you do two damage, but I'll soak it on my guy who's got a big yeah. bottom of eight. Yeah. And so I score those two. Yeah. That'll get me six, so that takes me to 12. Yep. Yeah. And then I can draw an additional three extra dice this turn, so I'm up to nine. Yeah. So I've got one die in here, so these yeah. two go into there. I can cull two dice as well, but I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So if I cull two, I'm guaranteed to roll them all. Yeah. But there's no use because I've got a, a draw die, so I might as well keep one. Okay. Right. That's right. Keep one, so that's going to be rolled. Put these in and draw out eight. Just yeah, so sometimes you've got to do that little bit of maths, otherwise you make a mistake like culling some and you think, well, why have I got this draw one? It doesn't help me anymore. So, oh, this has gone wrong. Uh, let's hope this is a, a mana, because that'd be brilliant for me. Well, I'll just buy a dragon. No, no, I can live with that. No, draw one. one. Well, spent. hang on, hang on, hang on. It's been on the meter. Yeah. Oh, it's, a, it's a knight. It's a knight. What type of knight? Oh, oh two oh. mana knight. You give buy a dragon? Yes. Right. Yes. And that's it, Just right? pass me a dragon. There is a dragon, David. I feel that was a, a a momentous shift in terrible luck. So I get two glory. You get two. One, two, and you can colour a, a die if you wish, just to get rid of one of your base ones. I should have culled a couple. I would have called a couple. But the problem is, then I would have gone, oh, I've got all these dice I can, dice I can draw, and I can't. But then it would have guaranteed me, at least, having all of them. I was very unlucky not to draw. It was very unlucky. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm happy about it. And the roll was bad. 
Oh, to be fair, that's I'm going to re-roll bad. those two. So you, could, but the dragon also has a re-roll if you want to use. Yeah, yeah, it. I'm going to re-roll those two because I get to re-roll and another one, right? Yeah, but you can wait and see what you draw. Yeah, yeah. So I can put them here for the moment. Yeah, put them all up there. Oh, that was that. Yeah, I'm going to cheat. So draw two more. This is where the portal strategy just comes into its own because you just keep drawing Spent. portals and portals and portals. No. I'm going to yeah, re-roll yeah. these two. Two dragons! Oh. So that cost me six to cast it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Luckily I didn't have anything out, so it's not as if he can wipe the board of my men. There you go. So I guess that was quite lucky, actually. Mm. Somehow I managed to luck out. Uh, so these two are out, yep. and then I've got four more. Right, well, what's that going to score you? Eight. Eight. And you're on nine. Wow, that's going to put you... Seventeen. Really close. One, two, three. Yes. Right, I think this is the last two turns. Okay. One way or another, I think one of us is going to win this. Well, that's what I needed. And that's what I needed. And that's what I needed. And that's what I needed. So... Right. Two dice. Yes. I've just got to kill one of them, we'll get to seven. Oh, I can't do it, I don't think. No, no, you can't at all. No. Right, so, I have enough to cast these two, which has to happen, doesn't it? Just two. Yeah, I'll use that die because it's quickest. Yeah. And then one, two, four. three, four. Can I get anything that's going to help me next turn? Uh, this? A portal die. Yes? Yeah, it's got to be. Bing. Bingo, bongo, bongo. And so, I can't attack anyway, because they're both level ones. Yeah. Oh yeah, that wouldn't have helped. So, so you score. I score. Ding, ding. Cull two. Uh, you might as well. And you score a total of... Uh, do you have to... Don't do that? Hang on. I don't want to do that. 17. 17. Do you want to do? No, I want cull two. Yeah, you do. You just want to, you want to get as few in your hand as possible. Oh, there it is. Uh, draw two. Uh, draw two. Damn it. Because I could have stolen one of your dragons. Oh, I have a dragon in here. You do have a dragon in there. You bought one. I think. Yes. What do I need? I need so eight. So, cast this for one. What's he worth? He's worth two. One, two, three, four, five, six. I've got six to spend. Uh, I will get myself... It's all got tense viewers. A knight. A knight. I think I'm gonna get an extra die. Right, sorry, it's me being weird. Uh, you attack for two. Yeah. I absorb with my yeah. pale knight, uh whatever his name is. Strong defender of the pale. Yeah. Uh, I score a total of five, taking me to seventeen as well. Yeah. I will cull these two dice. Mm -hmm. And pop it all into that should all be there, and then I'm going to get an extra one die. Yeah. So I've got those four. I'm so excited at this point. I can see victory. I can smell it. Unless you, I didn't. Don't roll your dragon. And so three more. So it makes a total of seven. What was a portal. I saw a portal. Portal knight dragon. I think I got this. No. So that is in fact horrendous, but you get to roll one more side. This is why you keep your um, assistance, actually, because you just get those re-rolls when you need them. Oh, it's all gone wrong, people. It's all gone peaty tong. What would you like to buy? Would you like to buy a dragon? <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I'm... Yeah, I'll two, buy a dragon. Two glory for yeah, me. Yeah, I'll buy a dragon, but I'm basically going to have to concede. That is the worst luck I have seen in a long while. Okay, I've got these. But at least you have nothing inactive. Well, you've got to do what I did, basically. So, four. Uh, you were on 19, sir. 19. So do you got want a colour die? I've got... Just uh, for the fun of it. Yeah, go on. I'll go that. colour dragon. No. So, I'll do that. Uh, got him. I'll, I'll roll these. I've got a dragon and a draw two. So, two, two more. Let me, let's move them out of the way. Might as well finish this. Yeah, I'll let him So, move. two more is my actual draw, I think, isn't it? Yeah, so that's four. Yeah. And then... And then I've got draw three. Yeah. Oh, I 
so close. I can't. I can just about cast that dragon as well. Because if I, the thing is, if I could have got my dragon out, your dragon wouldn't have been able to kill my dragon in time. Yeah, you're in. So it does, it, that does not matter. So that lets me cast the dragon and the knight. Uh, so I can do that. Yeah. Um, so that's four. No, three is that one. That leaves me with four mana to spend. Uh, let's see what I can do to defend myself. What have we got? We didn't do anything else, did we? You didn't bother. I'm going to. I cast took a this. dragon. Yeah, you took a dragon. Uh, I'm going to take a kill spell. Yeah. Well, this all comes down to whether or not. I can't take a kill spell, that's cheating because it costs five, not four. <laughs> uh, I'll take this one because I don't know what it does, right. but it's fun. I've got these three dice. Well, technically, I, I mean, it could go on, but looking at my luck earlier, it's not going to happen. You need to better kill both of these. Yeah. That's what I mean. It's just not. Yeah, yeah. I need. You need a two dragons. Of not 11. I need two dragons, basically. One, two, three. Well, I've got two dragons, two knights, one quiddity, and a portal. Yeah, I've got two dragons. Why not? Oh, sorry. Two creatures. <laughs> My head's gone. You can't afford to cast them all. Is this you're going to have it? Yeah. Well, I've got a portal for one. Well, that's the big dragon. Okay, that's good. That's eight. Portal you... for one. Oh, I've got another quiddity. I can okay. afford to cast... Oh, and he's a level two. Oh, that means he can't attack. Oh, poo. Yeah, well done. Because it's eight, you will soak. I'll soak that into yeah, the night, doesn't no. matter. Well done. Yay! Portals again. I think, well, I had, I, I had a bad roll the turn before, and you had that turn to do it, and it all no, went I had two well. super bad roll. I had two super bad turns. Anyway, let's review this. Yeah. Well, that was good. We like playing these sort of games. Uh, I'd be interested to see when we do our review, if we do our review of Dice Masters, how it compares, because they're very similar, obviously, by the same company. And... Yeah, this was the predecessor, this was the granddaddy of Dice Masters. But I really, this is what obviously got me really interested about Dice Masters, yes. was this game particularly, because I've played the main game with loads of the expansions as well. I think I played it with some of my other friends. Uh, but I really, really enjoyed this game. But let's do our 3P system. Yes. And then out six. And you're going first. I'm going to go first, why not? I'm going to give this. Oh, it's a good, it's a real strong one. Uh, it's definitely a purchase, hundred yes. percent purchase. There's no like the problem is, is it, it the the, the, issue, the only issue with this game is that when you see the box, it has a really high price point. Like it's about fifty quid. Yeah. But once you start realizing how many of the dice it, the, how many dice you get in it, and also uh, some of the dice you do get have issues with them, like they've uh, not printed properly or stuff. But if you contact WizKids directly straight away, not straight away, but you basically go WizKids, these dice are not correct. Uh, let them know, and they will then send you brand new dice to replace yeah, them. But also, away. they're so clearly defined that yeah. actually, it's, it could be like a little five in the corner. But you can always tell from the cards what it yeah, was yeah. anyway. I've got a couple. I never bothered. I just went. We know what they are. It's fine. Because I have seen some that have actually just completely not got anything printed on them. Like a complete oh. blank die. It's like, oh, that's not good. So they got those it. fixed. But again, that could be just a different printing process and stuff as well. So maybe they've, they've refined that and fixed that sort of issue. But I really like this one. You, you, once you get the hang of, they use they like to use the word qu at the front of everything. And it's hard to say certain things. Like this one is... You walk into the shop and you go, can I have the latest expansion for Quarriers, please? Yeah, yeah. And it's like, quest of, quest, quest of... I can't even say quest. Apparently that's actually a word, though. Quest of the Quadiator. Yeah, that one really didn't trip off the tongue, did it? Um, but we really enjoy this game. Yeah, purchase as well. Purchase, purchase, purchase. Purchase, yeah. purchase all the way. High price point, but that will probably come into your score. Yeah, yeah, once you see the dice and stuff. But once you see all the dice, you start going, because it's like, is it 148, I think the original box says? It's what we call a segue. I'm not doing it. You can't make me do nothing. Uh, now we're going to go into the scores. Uh, I'm going to give this a very strong four and a half. Like, it's creeping towards a five. I think there's a few. I think, I think the price point is the one because I've seen many people come into my shop and literally go, "That's a lot." But then you go, "There's a lot of dice in there as well, though, and dice are not cheap to make." Oh, one of the things you also didn't see when we set it up is each die comes with multiple cards. Yeah. So whilst you look at it and you go, "Well, there's a lot of dice," but each and each card is very different, plays very differently, has a different cost, has a different glory. Uh, everything works very differently about each card. Yeah, because some of the dragons in there literally just destroy everything in the, the battlefield. And that's like, oh. We didn't think that would make for a good mur game. Murder, death, kill. It just sort of goes, everything that's there dies. Yeah. And it's just like, oh, that's quite good. But the number of players changes the game dramatically. Yes, because you score a lot less. But obviously, there's a lot more attacking going on. Yeah. So you, you, you have don't less need to, to score. score as many victory points for, for winning. 
Because we went to the max, right? 20. Yeah, two player. Two player. And it was close, player. very close though. Very close. Yeah. Uh, what about you, David? I'm five and a half. Ooh. I think this is a near perfect game because it doesn't have some of the issues that um, something like Di uh, Dice Masters will have in terms of that collectability, okay. which they are getting over with some of their recent releases. But so everything's in the box, you get everything you need. It has enough random with the dice that I think some Euro gamers will be put off, but most of the time you have enough choice. I mean, you saw it in that game, I had a couple of rounds where I just got humped by the yeah. fact that I couldn't roll a creature. But if I'd chosen a different path, if I'd chosen spells instead, yep. a lot of the spells have extra abilities, so it's not just quiddity that you get, and you can have those spells floating for turn after turn, waiting, and that pulls them out of your dice bag so that you're not drawing them out. There's lots of different avenues to victory in this that I think you don't necessarily see on the first play, or even the fourth play. And each card changes, each spell changes each time, yep. three of each. I think it also is so well organized once you get one of these plastic trays. They are amazing dice. They have like a nice box. You could get me on a game with good dice. Anything that has really well made custom dice. Get in the van, I've got some dice. Yeah, oh, nearly, <laughs> very nearly. I think it's, it is a near perfect game because it's so well contained, so much fun. You can spend hours. If you've got a lovely sunny day and a nice you know, play mat and no friends that throw dice too far, I didn't throw it, they per just bounced. You could sit in the garden and play, you know, you know, whatever you want. It's such a great game. Yeah, yeah. I spent days, I've lost days, just playing over and over again. I love it. Five and a half. Wow. Strong review. Uh, so, I think that's the end of uh, Quarriers. Yeah. So, uh, been missing you, Geek. You know where to find us. Bye. Bye. I'm out. You like when people recognise you've got some great things you've designed. Hi, this is what you get inside the box. Is that how you're actually no. doing it? Oh yeah.